Good morning, guys. Well, I'm up my second set. Just got this nice wrap in it. Don't have anything in the first one. But anyhow, today I'm pulling out to traps. I've got to go home this afternoon, so it's supposed to be plus 15 here in a couple days' time, so I can't leave these traps set. I might not be getting them if I do, so this wrap in here. And continue on. We're at set number three, and it looks like I have rat number two here. Out. I don't think it's live, so. Drowned. Small one. House back up. Get the rat on the trap. Pretty cool this morning. It's north wind. It's hard to believe how much the day is going to warm up in the next couple days. It's that warm. The ice in these rushes, this cattails, isn't going to last very long. I'm here at the fourth set now, and I got another one here. So this is rat number three, I think. It should be. Ah, fooled me. Spire trap. I was hooked in there and I thought it was, thought it was a rat. Still continuing on here, pulling out traps. I think this is my sixth or seventh set. Looks like I got a rat in this one. Got around the neck. That's the way I like trapping rats with these corner bears and feeders, push-ups. Find a place where there's lots of push-ups and set, set these up. And pretty fast to check once you get them set. And don't stick in your hand and house and having rats biting at you. Anyhow, get it out and load it on. Keep moving on. I think I got rat number four here now. Trap there in the water. So hopefully it's drowned. Dry it off in the snow and load it up in the sleigh. Hopefully, get a few more. Ten yesterday, and that's four now today, so get another four or five will be good. Okay. Alright, the next trap from oh, we just the last trap. And you can see that the stick's been wobbling around here, so. Should have a rat in it, I think. So that's just the wind doing that. Ah, <laughs> must have been just the wind. Cool. Well, we're two traps later. The last trap didn't have anything. This one has something. Actually, I can see it right there. It's dead, so I guess it's safe to reach in there and grab it. Big rats, some smaller rats. That one's not overly big. Put the house back up. Get this guy loaded in the sleigh. Just pulled that nice rat out of this house. One way you can tell if there's still rats in the house. Plug from the inside, and you plug it from the outside. Pretty well plugging it on top. When you're opening up your hole again. If it's plugged from the inside too, then you know there's still rats in there using it. 
There's only two checks for these crops, so I was just like, this might have four or five rats. So leaving some for next year, I guess. The minks don't eat them all. Nice cattail marsh around the edge of the lake. Just poured myself a coffee. The last trap out. Six rats today only. I guess that's kind of to be expected. Second day checking the same trap. So yesterday I had ten. Six more. Oh, head back to the cabin now. I'm both, probably about four or five miles from the cabin. Pack stuff up and head home this afternoon. I'm going to upload this video tonight if I can. So finding out from Snake Lake.